Okay, today, unfortunately, I got to talk about kids with mental illness. Yay! My 25 year old daughter has been diagnosed with borderline personality disorder. She's supposed to be taking medication and uh, she hasn't been on her medication for a while and I knew things were going sideways because I could just tell by the way she was acting. And then today I happened to get an email from a my credit one of my credit card companies saying that uh, oh you had a, a interesting charge and I looked it up and it was like <laughs> what so you know didn't occur to me at all like I thought maybe my husband charged something and didn't tell me hang on I gotta throw the frisbee for the dog okay. Anyway, so I called the um, the credit card company, and there was a couple of charges, and one of them was at uh, a fast food place in the military base over here. We live close to Fort Campbell, and uh, instantly. I knew who who did it. It was uh, a card on my account that was in my husband's name and he hadn't used that card in a year and it was in one of his drawers. Because you know, you think you can keep your stuff in your drawer in your own home, right? Anyway, uh, oh, got to throw again, hang on. Anyway, uh, our daughter works on the military base. She's the only one who could have had access to the card, who could have taken it and tried to use it on the military base. She did two purchases this morning and she, when I confronted her on the phone about it, she called me crazy and she didn't do it. Of course, she didn't say like, oh my God, somebody took dad's credit card? Oh, I don't, I don't know, you know, none of that stuff. Just, I didn't do it. I didn't do it. So, just a minute, BB, put it down. Okay, walk away. So gross. <sighs> anyway, she's denied it and denied it and denied it. But facts are facts. And then I looked, we have um, a uh, locator on the phone for, uh, we can see where the kids are going. My husband can see where I'm going. I can see where he's going. And it keeps a record of where you stop. <laughs> and lo and behold, it shows my daughter stopping at the coffee shop that she spent the credit card at. And it shows her at the fast food joint on the military base right at the same times that the charges were. She still says she didn't do it. She she didn't do it, but of course she did. I I knew that things were getting out of hand. I've been after her for a while, and you've got to be on your medicine, you know. And then she finally admitted she wasn't taking it, 
and then she said she went and got some and she said she's taken it but she's told me that before and not done it you know she's told me oh yeah I've been I'm taking my medicine I'm taking my medicine and turns out she's not okay go on back up where'd it go there anyway there's you know it's proof positive uh, it shows her at the places where the card was charged at the exact times the card was charged and uh, she's the only one who could have done it I mean it's on the military base it's not like we can go on the military base and charge but again it shows her at the exact place at the exact time that the stuff was charged so of course she did it but again like I was saying she hasn't been taking her medicine she's lied before about saying she has taken it which I knew was a lie because uh, you can tell by the way she acts she's scattered beyond scattered she's mean and hateful she's um, uh, dirty just gross dirty and back up and I mean Pigs die dirty. I mean, she, and then, you know, you ask her to do something, she'll say she'll do it, and then she just doesn't, you know. So it's extremely frustrating. It's something I've been dealing with. Um, she has a five year old son, which makes it harder because she doesn't take care of him properly, and because she's not on her medication and not in her right mind, she doesn't think anything's wrong with her. You know, when she's on her medication, she can see that what she was doing was, was not good. And she knows that she's better on the medication and that she really needs it, blah, 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 blah. But after she's been taking it for a while, then she doesn't see it anymore. She's like, I I'm fine. I don't need this. So she stops taking it and then everything goes to hell. All right, baby, back up. Back up. So, anyway, it's been a rough day today. It's been rough, and it's going to be rougher. But thank God, my husband finally comes home tomorrow. Uh, and the you know what's going to hit the fan. It's going to get. It's going to get bad. I just know it. So I'm not really sure I'm going to try to ignore her today when she gets home, but I'm, <laughs> I'm super pissed. I mean, you know, I'll put up with a lot of stuff. But don't, don't effing steal from me. Don't steal from me. And especially over stuff as trivial as bath food and takeout coffee. <sighs> anyway, thanks for listening to my rant. Um, if anybody has any suggestions for me of what to do, uh, I would really appreciate it because, you know, I, I've been dealing with this for so long. I'm just... I'm just kind of glad actually to get it off my chest right now. So thanks for listening. And uh, if you're going through anything like this, please uh, comment, please share. Um, if you have suggestions, please let me know what they are. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.